Lasagna here and hi, and in today's video we'll be drawing digitally. So um I won't be needing this camera for now. So um I'll roll the brand new intro and I'll see you guys after it. Okay, so when I draw digitally, I like to first start off with a sketch. But I do it really roughly with just the important details. You know, for in this case, I'm going to draw like some Spider-Man suit. So I'm just going to draw like the head and the eyes. Doesn't have to look too good, just to a point where it looks pretty good. So I like to like do a little bit of copy and paste to make everything look symmetrical. And redo it a couple of times. Okay. And then I go on a new layer to start outlining. As, as you guys can see, I messed up quite a lot. And I even had to use this arc tool. But um, it doesn't really matter as long as it looks good. So the sketch has to look pretty good, but then you want to make the fine lining actually look good. This is where all the details are. So you just want to outline everything, the important parts, and the eyes. And um, it's okay if you have to redo something. You just undo it, and then you can like make the size difference and stuff. It's actually very important to do that. Then you add, then I just add these final details and stuff, and fix up stuff that I don't like. That's the beauty of drawing digitally. You can undo everything. Then I add some things that I didn't add in the original sketch because doing it digitally I can rub it out if I have to. So just experimenting now. It doesn't have to look perfect and I'm happy with this. So now I'm just doing the colors. I'm doing blue for these sections because I'm trying to make like a glow effect. You guys will see how it looks later. It's not the best, but you just want flat colors. That's all you really want at this point. And just flat colors on everything. Then I grab like this rubber tool that just makes it lighter and gives it more of a light effect. Then I start experimenting with different colors for the. I don't know what to, how to describe about the other color of the suit, but see, so yeah, I decided to use this purple. I think it looks nice, so I just start coloring in with the fill tool and a little bit with the um actual pen because I'm using the Concepts app, which doesn't have a proper fill tool for some reason. Okay, see, just flat colors, nothing too fancy, and you don't want to go over the lines or anything. If you do, just redo. Okay. See the. Only thing I don't like about digital drawing is the feel. It's not as nice as drawing on paper. It feels very different. But um, yeah, now I did some rubbing out for shadow effects, and I use the airbrush on different layer for shadows on a different layer. And then I rubbed out everything that went over the lines. Yeah, continuing to try to make that effect. I didn't do a perfect job, but it looks decent. Gets the job done. Then I start adding this rim light, makes it pop out more, I think it makes it look nicer. Just on one side of the artwork, looks like it's coming behind the character or something. Yeah, and then I tried adding another one, green, but I don't know, it didn't look nice. Okay, now I'm adding this dotted texture. See, I kind of, I was meant to not do it on the blue, but I actually did it on that one spot, but... It doesn't really matter, honestly, but now I'm just trying to find a background just to make a quick one, you know, and, um, yeah, that's really it. I hope you guys liked it. This was just an inside of my art process, so, I mean, it's not perfect, but I hope you guys liked the video, and, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.